the 1st of January 2019, I decided that I was going to learn to handstand. I wanted to do this mainly just because it's a cool thing to be able to do, but also because it unlocks a lot of other movements which are impossible to do without it. I decided to at first say I've completed this goal, where completed is in large quotation marks because I'll continue to work on it after meeting a goal, that I would have to hold a handstand for 15 seconds. I just felt that this amount of time was sufficient to say I could somewhat control myself in the position. I opted not to watch any tutorials for the first month or so because I find that if I watch too many tutorials for things I get bombarded with information trying to do 58 things simultaneously and I don't think that's really the best way to learn something. One of the first things I noticed that actually surprised me quite a lot was how much I had to rest between attempts. I found that my shoulders often got a little bit too tired and I couldn't actually put in a quality attempt after trying it 10 times in the previous 10 seconds. A massive amount of the battle for me was the kick up. I found that once I'd reached a stable position I could often hold it for a couple of seconds, but just to get back to that point would take me quite a few attempts. It was always a bit of a matter of luck whether I kicked up too much, too little or just the right amount, and it was just practice that helped me improve that to getting up most of the time now.
like I was stuck at a six second hold. I wasn't quite as stable as I would have liked to be and kept instinctively walking on my hands. I kept practicing putting on pressure with my hands onto the floor until on January 26th this happened. So uh, goal completed then, right? Well, not really. Uh, well, I did reach 15 seconds. I wasn't entirely happy with this handstand. If you look at it more closely, I developed the bad habit of moving my hands around on the floor rather than applying pressure with my fingertips. Also, my back is quite arched with my feet actually dangling in front of my head, which isn't really great. Uh, like it's just less athletically pleasing than the straight back handstand, so I decided to work on it a little bit more and uh, see if that improves it. It was at this point that I allowed myself to look at a few tutorials, working on straightening out my back. I hope you think the same, but I think it paid off. I also improved my best handstand time to somewhere near 20 seconds, I'll, I'll show you the time on the screen uh, when, it, when it actually, when I bother editing this. Uh, my, uh, my position is also much more stable than it was before, I can hold myself there without walking around on my hands, which is very nice. Uh, I would consider my goal of 15 seconds to be truly met. Is my handstand perfect? It is not perfect at all, but I think that it's good enough to start working on some more advanced goals. And uh, if you'd like to see me do them, make sure you subscribe to the channel to see them in the near future.